<laughs> I've got a question for you, Dad. Yeah. Bolton have just um, signed a couple championship players. Declan John from Swansea, a, a, a really fast left back. Uh, we signed Kieran Lee from Sheffield Wednesday, a, a, yeah. a championship quality level. He yeah. was playing in the championship regularly last yes. year, centre mid. We're in League Two. I mean, that's a massive difference. We're signing really good players this January, and clearly the board want us to get promoted, at least playoffs. Yes. Second half of the season, we're doing a title charge, as Andy Tate will say for you United fans. Not in that accent, though. He did. He did say that. Honestly, really? that was brilliant for me. My point is, do you think these new signings can help Bolton push on and maybe get promoted out of League Two? Well, I'm, I'm hearing good signs, both from the Bolton chat online and, and from supporters of the clubs you've just mentioned who've written to me and said Thog Dad you're getting a good player there. Yeah. So from what I've heard it all sounds positive but you know until we see them play half a dozen games we don't know. Yeah. And, and part of the problem with Bolton this season as you've taken a new manager, new owners, new setup playing in front of new fans and it's taken a while to gel. Yeah. But if you true. look at the league, okay, what, we're 15, something like that. We're not a million, we're only two or well three. Well done, lads, well done, lads. Two or three that? wins away Villa, lads. from Just tackled the Salah, playoffs. Lads. But going back to what we're saying, Bolton, we've signed a couple of players, we might sign a couple more. Yes. We're highly yes. linked with a few more, like, serious talents. You, you sign four championship level players. I mean, with the players we have already, like Owen Doyle, we've got some serious, Neko William beats his man really well. Ooh, oh, but he goes back out. No. Great defending there. Great defending from the 16 year old. Ian Everett, is he yeah. the man for you? Yeah, look, you've got to stick with him. He did a great job when he was at Barrow last season. You can't give a guy half a season with a new squad and expect miracles straight away. Yeah. I mean, come on, let him let him get on with his job. So, yeah, give yeah. him time. Yeah. And that is, look, in general, unless a manager is completely hopeless, in general, just stick with him. If you if you bring a CEO into a, a non-football business, you, yeah. don't, you don't get rid of them after you don't. 30 days or six months. You give them a year or two. And yeah. unless they really, really mess up or unless they steal from the till or something stupid, you stick with them for a while. And already, the bold players we've got in, Delfonso, Owen Doyle, these lads should be smashing it in League 2. We've got... Um, is Grove. We've got yeah. bloody... Okay, the only situation we need, to, we need to deal with is a keeper. By the way, Villa on the attack here. Hit it, oh hit it, God. hit it. Two shoots. <laughs> I played to him, man. Yeah. To, uh, to, to basically wrap up what we're saying about Bolton, I think we'll get promoted. I think we will make playoffs and I do think we'll win it. Um, I've got a feeling we'll have a good momentum run in the second half of the season. We've got such a better team than everyone in the league. I hope it clicks. But it gets to a point where the lads are so good, there has to be a difference in quality, doesn't it? Absolutely. Like, these are players that if we were in the championship, we'd sign and be happy about. And we're in League Two. So, yeah. yeah, it's good. It's good. We're getting better as a club. And I'm looking forward to it. I think Ian Ever, trust Ooh. in him. Keep the faith. So, yeah, Bolton fans, don't get don't get too Evan out yet. You know, let him <laughs> let him do what he can with the, the January transfer window. Yeah, get the yeah. team he wants. Because, obviously, there was a bit of a, a dilemma. We sacked the, the kind of transfer geezer. We sacked yeah. someone in the club. I mean, who was meant to be part of who we were meant to be signing. And then a lot of players that Ian Ever what, didn't have a massive... I don't know what's going on. What I'm trying to say is... Yeah. He's got a chance in January to sign the players he wants... And uh, we'll find out what he does. So good luck yeah. to Bolton up the white. Thank you, Joe O'Halloran, for the £5. Do so you think Bolton being in League Two has a blessing in disguise for the channel as you have no bias towards them against other Premier teams? I never thought about that. Well, look, it's, it, that's a good question. I think if Bolton were in the Premiership, that there is the danger that as commentators on football, we'd be, we'd be biased. Yeah. I mean, purposefully, we don't stream Bolton games. We, First we, of all, a lot yeah. of you don't want that. Yeah. Secondly, it's only the true TDL members. We'd just be know, biased. Yeah. So look, the next time that we're allowed to go to a Bolton Wanderers game, wherever we're, we're it is in there. the world, we're, we're we'll be there. I'd have my beer in my pocket and we'll be there. For me, I felt this season's a bit weird. It's almost like a non-season for Bolton. Yeah, it is. It is. Partly because I can't be there. For me, being a Bolton fan is about being there. Yeah, my dad's seen seen Bolton way longer than me because of his yeah. age, right? And, and oh, Wijnaldum, Wijnaldum. Shoots! Ooh. Great block for the Villa centre-backs there. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, let me just find out their names. These two have been doing a shift all game. Bayern Munich, oh my God, the game's Ooh, going crazy. 2-1. Good question. So that's the answer Bolton question. 